Hurricane season, obviously, we take very, very seriously at Home Gas. It's all about preparation for us. So pre-hurricane season, we do a large order of spare parts, so regulators, fittings. Um, we also do orders of tanks, etc. So if we do have an incident, then we've got the backup there to be able to get people up and running as soon as possible. We learned a lot from Hurricane Ivan. We learned that it's better for us to place vehicles around three areas of the island. We actually split our service and delivery teams into uh, three hurricane teams, and they cover uh, the western part of the island, Georgetown, and then the eastern districts. Pre-hurricane season, we work very closely with Offreg and the hazard management team and the government. Uh, any requirements that they need, and we meet those requirements. Uh, in fact, we can exceed those requirements. Our storage, we ensure that we have um, topped up as well, which is 540,000 wet gallons. We make sure we've got equipment, got uh, vehicles that are running out in the sister islands as well. We currently have 30,000 gallons of storage in Cayman Brac. We have around 5,000 gallons of storage in Little Cayman. Um, all our tanks, which are behind me, they um, are what we call mounded tanks. So they're mounded under the earth and then protected with tiling. So in the event of a hurricane, we've got very good protection of our tanks because obviously our, our tanks are the lifeline to the rest of the island. We have to protect them and protect that infrastructure. All of our guys as well, they've all got high level of training. Uh, they, we follow the CTEP uh, qualification, which is the same accreditation that they use in the United States. And we keep that up together every three years. Um, with regards to safety um, tests, etc., we offer that as a free service. Anybody can ring us and we'll come out and check their system for free, make sure they're all safe. And we do a pre-hurricane inspection as well. So anybody who wants us to come out, check their tank, check their installation, or even if they just haven't got gas and they're thinking of putting it in, because obviously, you know, with, with hurricanes, we do lose power. Um, and it gives it that option then that you're still able to cook, etc., if you need to after the event.